Welcome to another First at Home video, and this is our Wednesday evening prayer service. And tonight we will be looking at light. We'll actually be looking at the light of a candle and uh, focusing on that flame and focusing on, on what, we're, what we're feeling and what we're, what we're thinking. And so if you'd like, stop the video for a bit and go get a candle uh, to uh, be able to light here in just a little bit. Um, I do have a candle here on the altar that I will be lighting um, also. So if you want to just watch on online, you can, but uh, you might want to go get a candle. So I'll pause just a bit. All right, so I'm going to light the candle for our readings. Our first scripture is from John chapter 8, verse 12. When Jesus spoke again to the people, he said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will never walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. And then from Matthew chapter 5, verses 14 through 16. Jesus said, You are the light of the world. A city built on a hill cannot be hid. No one, after lighting a lamp, puts it under a bushel basket, but on a lampstand, and, gives, and it gives light in all the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, so that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father in heaven. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, you sent Jesus into this world so long ago to be the light, to be the light that would guide us through the darkness of this world, through the struggles that we have. We give you thanks for bringing us light, for bringing us Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So if you have your, your candle now, you Maybe you want to take a look at that flame and just look at how it moves around a little bit, um, how, there is, how there is warmth and light that comes from that flame. And if you do have your candle burning in front of you, you can almost or sometimes see the wax actually going up through the wick and uh, the fuel um, feeding, feeding that fire to shine the light into the world. I think in many ways, God is that fuel that helps us to shine our light. Uh, and we need to be recharged. And scripture, prayer, time together, talking about our faith is a way to, to have that fuel, uh, to shine our lights, put back into us. So at this time, let us pray. As you gather around your candle, Heavenly Father, we thank you for the light that, that shines into this world and that gives us guidance, gives us direction. We ask that you would today give the world the guidance that it needs, the guidance that we need uh, to shine our light uh, to others. At this time, we pray that you would fill us with your spirit, that you would help us to focus on what it is that you are calling us to do. Help us to focus on the task that, that we have at hand today. Help us to focus on what it is that you want us to do to make a difference in the world today. This time, I invite you to lift up your own prayers as our music begins. Come. 
Lord, I ask that you would shine your light into our hearts, that you would shine your light of forgiveness and love into the dark places in our hearts, in our minds, and in our lives. Shine your light, brighten our way. Once we are filled with your spirit, that you have shown your light into our lives, that you would help us to shine that light into the world around us, help us to make a difference in the lives that we run into each day. Lord, I ask that you would give us the courage, the strength, and the wisdom that we need as we shine your light into this world, as we proclaim your good news. Lord, help us. Give us the strength we need. In your name we pray. Amen. Receive the blessing. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you his peace. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.